Good morning, everybody. <clears throat> a beautiful Saturday morning. I'll tell you, I, this weather right here is just perfect for me. I love it. I'm getting ready to go check to see if we have more baby rabbits. Got my morning coffee. Cannot go without my coffee. I just, I can't do it. Been drinking coffee since I was four years old. My grandpa introduced me to it. Keep hearing some gunshots over this way. It's opening day of dove season here. And I wish I had a place to go. It's doves aren't easy to come by here, or at least for me. Let's see what these mamas have to offer us this morning. I mean, I'm gonna have to set my coffee down since I'm holding the camera. All right, there's that. Let's see here. Sally, girl, you got any babies in there? Uh, oh yeah, there we go. We have some babies. Sally had her babies. Let's see here. Looks like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Sorry about that. I couldn't hold the camera and that lid up and count all at the same time. I counted eight little babies. We'll leave them be. Here, oh, we got a baby out on the wire. We got a baby out on the wire. There's a baby out there on the wire. I'm not sure how I'm gonna get him either. Hmm. Put your head back in here. This could be interesting, guys. Because I really don't want to get bit. Alright, I think I'm going to have to set the camera down to get him out. I'll, let you, I'll give you guys an update on whether or not I can get him. Or if I get bit. Alright, I was able to get the baby back in. It was very tricky. She was uh, used a handle of a, um, of a little short hose, the one that we use to clean out those boxes. And I was able to block her enough that I could reach my hand through and grab the kit, but she was attacking that handle like crazy. Now let's check on this girl. And I see a hole back in there. That could be good news. I don't know if I can zoom in on that or not. It looks like there might be babies in it. This is another one I want to set the camera down for and count babies. Well, I didn't count any babies. Um, unfortunately, I, if she didn't have any babies soon, I'm going to call her. Since she was an auction rabbit, that could be why she was at the auction. Could be because she's not a very nice rabbit, too. We haven't been attacked by her yet, but the noises she makes when, when we are in there says it's a possibility that she's going to bite us. We don't want to take that chance. And we don't want to sell her to somebody else, taking that chance that somebody might get bit. I, I don't want to do that. These guys here, I'm hoping this weekend I can get time to butcher them. I'm debating on whether or not to show that on video. Um, 
I don't know if you guys really want to see that or not. I, I need more practice butchering, I feel like, before I go and showing it on video, on a vlog. So I'll think about it and I'll let y'all know. It is a beautiful bright day. It feels like it could get hot, but it feels nice right now. So far, pigs are eating their breakfast out there. I can hold the camera right. And here they come. I think I brought them treats. I didn't. Alright, it's time to get this day underway. Alright, so we're going to do a little interview with all the kiddos this weekend. And I'm going to write down their answers. And in a couple, maybe five years, I'm going to ask them these same questions. See how much it changes. This is Jasper. You can tell them how old you are. Seven. Seven. What is your favorite part about living on a homestead? I don't know. Just having animals. Having animals. What's your favorite animal that you that we've got here? My pigeons. Your pigeons. What's your least favorite thing about living on the homestead? Having Ida attack us while we're trying to go on a picnic. Well, chicken coop. You mean Lakota? Yeah, well, yeah, Lakota. <laughs> Lakota yeah, gets excited when you guys go out there, doesn't she? Yes. <laughs> why, don't you, why don't we go over and we'll show everybody the pigeons real quick, okay? These are his pigeons. He got them for his birthday. He fell in love with these guys at an auction. And I didn't get them for him at the auction. Uh, what he fell in love with, maybe, if we can get him to hold still long enough. Right here, you can see this guy down here in the water. Can you tell him what, what kind of pigeon he is? A fantail. Fantail pigeon. That is what he fell in love with. And now, he has got some regular pigeons. They're not, they're not the rollers or anything fancy like that. They're just regular pigeons. Eventually, I think he's wanting to get more fantails and try to raise him up and he takes care of him when he's here he comes out feeds him waters him he does a really good job with them so we're gonna let him raise him up and wherever they hatch out babies he gets to sell the babies uh -huh. what do you want us to get in the future More baby rabbits. More baby rabbits. We just had a whole bunch of baby rabbits. I know, but I love baby rabbits. Oh, okay. <laughs> I want more baby rabbits. They're cute. <laughs> yeah, very cute. Can you think of any uh, anything else you'd like to add to the homestead besides baby rabbits? No. I can. Cows. Cows. <laughs> I can. Well, you'll get your turn here in a minute, Miss Spiders. Layton. Spiders. <laughs> You're yeah, goofy. I have a banana spider. <laughs> it's huge. All right. So there's Jasper and his answers. <laughs> this is our little goofball, Layton. Layton, can you tell him how old you are? You got a birthday coming up soon, don't you? Uh-huh. It's going to be fun. I'm going to have balloons and stuff. And also new toys. New toys. 
What's your favorite part of having the homestead? Um, getting new animals. Getting new animals. <laughs> What's your favorite animal that we've got? Um, rabbits. The rabbits? Mm -hmm. Cause they're so cute when they're babies. <laughs> they're cute when they're babies. Mm -hmm. Do they taste good? Yeah. Yeah? <laughs> What's your least favorite part of the homestead? Um, uh, I am. Hmm. Going and feeding the animals. You don't like to go feed the animals? You don't like doing chores? I do. You do? Well, then what's your least favorite? Um, I like stuff. I got it. I got it. Clayton, What, Clayton? Clayton, Your rabbit's cute. Huh. Your least favorite, sweetheart. Yeah. Not your most favorite. Um, yeah. Is there anything here on the homestead that you don't like? The dog's jumping on me. The dog's jumping on you? They get a little excited when we come around, don't they? Hmm. It hurts when Tick jumps on me. He tries eating me. Oh, Tick don't try to eat you. <laughs> Silly. <laughs> what? He's mean sometimes. He's not mean. Tick's nice. Tick's an old man. Yeah. But only when you get in the circle, he be mean. <laughs> when you like... He jumps on you. <laughs> I hate that. Alright, let's... Goodbye! I think y'all have met Kale once before. Whenever he's helping us doctor the turkey. And whenever we showed y'all his, his garden that he started. Can you tell him how old you are, Kale? Seven. Seven. What is your favorite thing about the homestead? Helping out. Helping out? Helping out with what? Do chores and build stuff. Doing the chores and where we build stuff? What's your least favorite thing about the homestead? As you all can see, this is a very difficult question for the kids, and all three of them have had problems answering it. Feeding Lakota? Huh? Feeding Lakota? Feeding Lakota. That's your least favorite? Because she jumps up on you. And they all seem to have the same answer, eventually, where they come up with that. What do you want to see in the future on the homestead? Goats that way I can milk and cows. This guy is very excited to get milking goats. He has been talking about it for a long time. He really wants to milk goats, which would be fantastic to help us out. That way we got fresh milk in our house. We don't have to worry about going to the store and buying milk. All right, Kale, I think I'm done with you, and I'm going to talk to Chevelle now. Layton, I forgot to ask you, what is one thing that you would like to add to our homestead?
A goat? Did Kale just tell you to talk, say that? <laughs> what kind of a goat? Do you want meat goats or milk goats? Milk goats. Milk goats? So I can milk them. They're going to be my goats. Okay. I guess apparently we have two kids that are wanting to milk some goats. <laughs> All right, now we'll get Chevelle over here. And this is Chevelle, or Chevy. And tell everybody how old you are. Ten. Ten. You make it sound like you're in trouble right now. <laughs> what is your favorite part of having the homestead? Piggies. The piggies. I was waiting on somebody to answer that. <laughs> what is your least favorite part of having the homestead? Iris. Iris? Yeah, when it sparks at me. Iris is the little bitty spazzy dog that we got over there that likes to tear everything up whenever she's running loose. Yeah. She about bit me. She won't bite you. So what is something that you would change on the homestead? Wow! Having another Polish chicken. You want some more Polish chickens? Yeah. We've been working on it. She's had a couple Polish chickens before, and we've had bad luck with them. We had foxes down the road that we had problems with, and that was before we got Lakota. I think that now having Lakota, and once I get the new coop, it'll help too. I think that it'll, it'll save us a lot on our chickens. Is there anything you'd like to tell everybody? Um, no? <laughs> I'm thinking. You're thinking. My favorite color is pink. <laughs> favorite color is pink. <laughs> All right. And you guys got married. <laughs> <laughs> they know that. And what she's off. <laughs> Clayton, what is your favorite part of the homestead? Uh, a rabbit. Your rabbit? Do you know how old you are? Yeah. How old are you? Uh, Eight. Eight? Boy, sure do have a young face and pretty short for being an eight-year-old. You got eight. I've, I think you're three. Uh-huh. I think you're three. Uh, you Huh? Yes. You are. You're three. You are sleep. <laughs> yes, sleep. What do you not like about the homestead? Uh... Stickers. Stickers? Like pokey plants? <laughs> yep. Oh, there. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> the life of a three-year-old. Poor kid. Got a maid, don't even know it. You like nap time on the homestead? Yeah. Yeah. I think he's lying to us. He hates nap time. Why is tell me? I get in bed. Mommy tells you to get in bed? Yeah. I don't get up. Play outside. And then you want to get up and play outside? <laughs> you ready to go play? Okay. And he's off. What's your favorite part of the homestead, Missy? The country life. The country life? What's your least favorite part of the homestead? Nosy neighbors. We don't really have any nosy neighbors. No, well, ex-neighbors. Oh, well, that's true. Nosy ex-neighbors don't look close to us. They still think they have to check everything out. That's true. 
What's something that you want to change out here? I like the way you think. I agree. Yeah, yeah, it will. It'll be nice. It's nice knowing we work for everything that we have. Most of everything we have is paid mm -hmm. off, too. Yeah. That's nice to know, too. Uh, Except for the truck. Awesome. We broke down and had to, had to buy the truck, unfortunately. I didn't want to, but we had to have a truck. Mm -hmm. Poor van. We was hauling 700 pounds of feed in the van. Yeah. It, One day I hauled a thousand pounds in it. Didn't like that at all. Yeah, we decided then we're getting enough animals. We got to upgrade. We got to do something. Plus, I don't think that she would be very happy with me hauling goats. You go gaga? Oh, darn it! Huh? Called rabbits. They called ducks, chickens, turkeys, dogs, all in the van. <laughs> You go gaga. What'd you forget? I want it. I want another ducky that looks like Donald. Donald's a goose. Donald is from the Art and Bree channel that we watch all the time. Still, I want he's a, a goose. He's a guard goose. Still. We've talked about getting one. We just haven't done it yet. Wait till we get a better That's a change I want. And I want new flowers Bobby. up there. New flowers up there. Way up there at the corner. Where the bus can see them. <laughs> well, since everybody else answered the questions, I reckon I might as well too. My favorite part about the homestead is having stuff that we grow, stuff that we butcher, homegrown stuff. Like uh, the rabbits would probably be my favorite thing. My just highest on the list because they are self-sustaining they are very easy to take care of uh, I'd say that my least favorite thing is whenever crap breaks I'm not a mechanic I hate fixing stuff because I'm not a mechanic and I don't have the patience for it just like today I did get the ditches mode using my grandpa's bush hog got the ditches mowed started to mow or was getting ready to mow next door and the bush hog broke down uh as far as stuff that i can't wait to change or that i'm ready to change as amanda said the barns are going to be nice once we get them done the new house is going to be nice but i am ready for a tractor a tractor out here would be very handy and amazing. I would love to have a backhoe, but that's going to be a long ways down the road. I think that it, our, having our own tractor is in the very near future for us. Uh, unfortunately, that's going to come with a big price tag that I don't like, but we have, we need one. We have to do something. I'm going to have to learn how to drive it. Yeah, chill. I have to learn how to drive it, but I'm not going to get one that's too difficult for it to operate. Well, I think this is going to conclude our weekend deal out here. We didn't get near as much done, but I am off tomorrow. So I might be able to get some stuff filmed tomorrow for our vlog. Um, I'm not sure what all we're going to do. It just kind of depends on the weather and and what it brings. Work on the barn. Possibly. I don't know yet. Need to. Need to do that. You guys, I hope you had a good weekend and hopefully you're off tomorrow for Memorial Day or Labor Day, not Memorial Day, Labor Day. If you're not, bless you for working. Y'all have a good day. Thank you.